J. Prince Junior Moktai is pulled up on Honeycomb Brazy after he got released from jail. And this is really going crazy right now. Now, listen up, man. I'll tell you all why this is so, so interesting and why I'm reporting this because he's been bad blood ever since Honeycomb Brazy been in jail and he's been firing a lot of shots at J. Prince Junior Moktai's. But let's check this out, man. Listen up. This is what J. Prince Jr. you know got from Honeycomb Brazy when he posted this was like before he got released from prison he said like I can care less Junior know his love for real and I hold it down myself Junior sent me 1500 in two years I sent do triple dead and a month now I'm here watching everybody eat and nobody check on mom or my Junior I checked on little bro even his little brother so you all feeling like I am feeling, especially when I see you all throwing money to them non a ho like damn. So listen up, man. He's been bad blood, right? He's been bad blood ever since uh, Honeycomb Brazy got locked up and things been going crazy for him. So he's not been in good terms with J Prince Genius. So I was surprised to see them together in the club vibing. I mean, that was something I never expected to see, man. Now listen up man, it's all good at the end of the day because it's all love at the end of the day, right? We cannot agree to that, but the game is really crazy. You all seeing all these celebrities, you all seeing all these record lovers, man, they're showing fake love to each other. At the end of the day, they go behind the back, they're fighting and they're trying to expose each other. I mean, it doesn't make no sense to me at all. It doesn't make no sense to me at all. Now Honeycomb Brazy being in prison. J. Prince Jr. Moktaz wasn't checking up on him, only sent him 1500 and Honeycomb Brazy already sent him back the money, which is, you know, the dues that he gotta pay. And right now, Honeycomb Brazy is out of jail and he's trying to keep it on the low. Do you all remember? Immediately, Honeycomb Brazy got released from jail. Fennis two times started having some kind of misunderstanding allegedly with J. Prince Jr. and Moktaz, right? He started kind of pulling out from the whole contract. He even told us that he is not signed to Moftaz anymore. That was exactly when there was rumors and news that Honeycomb Brazy was released. And right now we can see that he is actually released from jail. He is out here clubbing. He is out here having a good time. So he kind of pulled back. And you all know at the end of the day, man, that Honeycomb Brazy already told Fennis two times when, when he was locked up that if he is out of prison and he finds out that he's still effing with mob ties or j prince jr then he's gonna make sure he destroys him and destroys his career and this dude is out of prison and he is out here clubbing with j prince jr mob i mean are they not supposed to be beefing but i don't know what it is man not like we enjoy the beef man but they brought all that attention to themselves at the end of the day mob ties is mob ties and Fennis two times already said that he is no longer effing with mob ties. He's not signed to mob ties. Then he's just a business partner with mob ties. And everyone already know what time it is. You feel me? Because right now that Fennis two times is denouncing mob ties and Honeycomb Brazy is out of prison. And everyone is watching the whole game, trying to look and trying to find out what's really going on behind the scene. You already know what it is, man. At the end of the day, he might end up there. Honeycomb Brazy is gone signed to Mob Ties or sign back to Mob Ties and, you know, become an artist under Mob Ties and start dropping music. And they wouldn't let Fennessy Times to be officially Mob Ties or to be officially signed to Mob Ties because right now the Honeycomb Brazy is out of prison. He got to get back to the game. And I think that J. Prince Jr. Mob Ties is trying to show love and trying to kind of let and it's, um, uh, Honeycomb Brazy know that at the end of the day, man, I still got you. I'm going to put you back in game, right? Because you were out here recently and you are showing a lot of love to Mob Ties and you are trying to make sure that everything is good with us, right? So I think that's what J Prince Jr. Mob Ties is trying to do at the end of the day. But for the two times, man, just sitting back and sitting elsewhere, looking at what's going on. You all seen that for two times, he's taking the money right now. He's taking the money for the shows. J Prince Jr. Mob Ties is no longer following him to the shows man he's just taking out the money for the shows you all seen that you all didn't notice that man that's crazy he's taking out the money for the shows bro right he's going to the shows. 
he's charging thirty thousand dollars he's charging 50k he's charging 60k and he's taking all the money no no record label right no record labels man and j praise junior is no longer really or rocking with him and that's what it is man this is the game right it's business at the end of the day business is business you all realize that so that's what's going on man so it's really crazy man you all let me know what y'all think because right now the honeycomb brace is back in the game back in the street you know we're gonna see what it's gonna be at the end of the day we're gonna see where mob ties is heading to at the end of the day and we're gonna realize that okay cool let's find out who is who man uh who is who is making the most money and that that's just what we want to know right so let me know what you all think under the comment section smash the like button subscribe to the channel turn on the notification bell so you'll get notified whenever i drop a new video and if you're feeling generous today can send super thanks to the channel or you can join the channel membership and i'll give you all a very big shout out catch you guys in the next video